Hello and welcome to a new video about measurement. We're talking about level measurement. Today we want to talk about a very simple approach, a swimmer method. Okay, so we have the level inside there, we have some something which swims in this liquid. Huh? So there's whatever shaped swimmer in there. Yeah? And there is some pointer which will point to a scale. Here we have a scale. And with changing, with changing, here we have holding tank or whatever, with the changing uh, position of the swimmer, yeah, we will change in scale. Yeah? So, if there is really a scale, uh, it could also be, you know, uh, maybe the scale is here, yeah? Scale is here. And then you have some rolls here, uh, and we have, you have a rolling, rolling, some, some, some ribbon, uh, something like that, uh, and, and use the scale. This is all working. However, this is not industrial usable. Yeah? Ha! Huh? We can combine. We can combine distance measurement on the scale yeah? and the swimmer method. So we are, there's a swimmer. Yeah? It can even look like that, that you have in here some rod with built-in distance measurement. Yeah? And here is the swimmer, special form swimmer somewhere and you're measuring the distance of the swimmer for instance with reed switches or something like that yeah we talked about distance measurement yeah and suddenly you can measure you can measure the position and it's industrial or it can be automated yeah? so it's not like just the scale yeah? it really can be automated and this makes this already pretty interesting for our application yeah however it's still very understandable still easy easy to understand yeah? and adjust and it's it's really accurate yeah? If you make a very accurate distance measurement, which can be quite accurate, this can really be accurate. All right, and and uh, on on different products, doesn't really matter as long as this thing swims. It's it's accurate. Huh? The downside is uh, well. Even if it's easy to understand and adjust, sometimes, especially for instance in pressurized tanks, it needs some some effort. Yeah, needs needs to need some installing effort. Yeah? This means it's relatively expensive. Okay, that's that's the downside. Yeah? It's quite often used. Yeah? It's quite often used. What is then not that expensive if it's not in, in a pressure tank? Yeah, for instance, in the oil tank of an hydraulic system where you measure uh, not not the pressure tank but just the oil tank, the oil reservoir. Yeah, you can measure the level with the swimmer method. This is very easy, very accurate, and you immediately see uh, if there is leakage in the oil system or something like that. Huh? So, level measurement with a swimmer. Next time, we're talking about level measurement also with the swimmer, but we are not really moving the swimmer. Yeah? How this is working, we will see in next video. For this time, thank you very much for listening. Goodbye.